Uh, hey guys, it's Mio here. It's my first After Effects tutorial. I got a request on how to do the Frog Guy, Spider Web, CC Vector Blur, etc. I already have my clip Twixtured. If you want to know how I use Twixter, just message me for a tutorial on that. Um, so, pretty much what I'm going to do is add an adjustment layer and go to Effect. And if you don't have this downloaded, you didn't get the full version, it will ask you when you download it. If you want to download extended plugins and extended what extended text things and CC vector blur, okay? And I'm just gonna show you what this looks like. It's a it's a it's an effect that I used in my video in my episode on the first clip right here. I'm trying to sound a little it's a little loud, but but this is what it looks like. And I, if you want to know how I get that smooth twixture not using Sony Vegas, if you could go like this and sub my clan channel, that would be greatly appreciated. Um, so pretty much what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and cut out the adjust um the adjustment layer control shift D. Whoa, nope, that's not what I want. So I gotta go to edit split layer and delete this one using backspace but um yeah where you want you where your clip is twixtured that's where you want it at and I twixtured at the reload reload and as soon as it goes to reload I'm going to go ahead and press E and go down to this for effect and amount I'm gonna keyframe it and then I'm gonna make it go into it and then I'm gonna keyframe it again at about 16 something like that that's a little too much I'm gonna go about 14 whatever looks best for you um, I like to use about 13 12 see how it like blurs everything out but you can just change this on off blurred um yeah and now we're just going to keyframe it about in the middle of your clip and the uh, where the twixture is about to end is about right there. So I'm gonna go about to the middle. I'm gonna keyframe it at about 14, so it goes up. And then when I want it to stop is when it's when the twixture stops. So about right there. I'm gonna keyframe it and put it back down to zero. But I wanna, um, I wanna also keyframe it in the middle again, and probably bring it back down to 12. So it looks like that, and then it brings it down. Um, I'm just gonna pull all this up. I'm gonna pre-ram view this, so I can show you all what it looks like. Uh, I'm gonna pause the recording, so um, yeah, when I come back, it should be done. Oh my god. Oh, See how it goes into it and it fades oh. out. That's what you want it to look like. So, uh, that's good and all. Uh, this is my um, CC Vector Blur tutorial. And if you want more tutorials, just message me. Uh, I'll try my best to help you out. I hope this helped you. Um, yeah, if you just want any more tutorials, just message me and I can help you out. Uh, but thanks for watching. Uh, I hope this helped you. I hope this helped you adjust a bit. But thanks for watching and subscribe, like, and comment.